What is up guys, Jim Poop here, back with more Mario and Luigi partners in time. And in the last video, we have gone through most, uh, we've gone through the Star Hill portion, and we've also, um, we've also gotten, uh, the, uh, the Star Shrine done, and, uh, also, uh, gotten bits of Shrewd Castle done, most of it. And so in this video, we're going to continue on. Uh, so... Uh, oh wow, we've got both at once. We've got tons of items here. Um, so we are going to go to the top of Princess Shrew Statue's Benny Button. But before that, it's just a pipe there. Okay, so let's go on ahead to see what's inside her. Then it trans, and then it changes the area to this. So there's a pipe here as well. And where does this lead? Back here! To the entrance of Peach's Castle. And so, let's just go on ahead. And the picture changes to this. Mario Luigi, Baby Mario and Baby Luigi excited! Okay, so let's go in here. We have a massive staircase. Just climb it in different parts. Before we go up there, is there anything this side? Yes, there is. Super Mushrooms, four of them! Wow! There's a Luigi block there. Max Mushrooms. Ultra Mushrooms. And Mario? My senses are pinging. Yes, no doubt about it. The Cobalt Star's acting fully insanitized, did that say? It's trying to tell us something. Let me interpret it. Thank you all for everything you've done. Now we must part. At least that's what I believe it's saying. All of you, please continue looking for Princess Peach. In the meanwhile, I will try and look for the whereabouts of Princess Rue. That is the generalized gist. And now it's gone. Come now, we must hurry and join up with the princess. Is there any enemies around here? If there isn't, then wow. Okay. A little further. So we're in a save area. Yeah, they're literally save. There's literally three save blocks here. Mario? Sorry for all the trouble. This will be... This will seem rather sudden. But would you please save our progress in this area? Uh, it's just... My forecast station sensors are clanging away. I do not believe we'll be able to return once we pass through that door. I would hate to boot up a regret cycle for our adventure. Isn't it smart to save? You know, save. You'll save, right? Then back to adventure! Why, why would he tell us to do that? Because obviously... Oh, there's a heart block here as well. Because some people can do this saveless. Regardless. There's a pipe here. I am going to say, but I'm not going to go through there yet because remember all the beans we have been collecting? Well, I'm going to go back to Farfel's place real quick to, um, to pretty much uh, see if we can get a good badge. And if not, then who knows what we can get. So we'll pay him a good last visit. At least we can go up here easily now. Uh, I'm not going to bother fighting those other enemies, because I didn't do that last time. I'm just going to speed things up. Okay. Here we go. So we're going to go back to Farfall. Might as well buy some items from the shop as well, because uh, we will be staying at um, the Shrewd Castle more frequently, so after this, so we're going to Farfall first, 
Oh wait, no, he's this way. Oh, I need to sneeze. Hmm? Oh god! I just sneezed. I don't care about fighting the Goombas. If, if I see one, I'll just get one. It's about the fact that we can still always just kill them. Because they're obviously, we're obviously more powerful than them. So let's just get him. Here we go. Let's go to Farful. I believe he is down here. I'm not going to get him yet. Oh, no, he's not there. It's just the Goomba. Okay. All right. Fair enough. Here we go again. Fighting the Goombas is so much fun. Because we can just kill him. Because we are so powerful. It's in here, I think. Okay. I don't know if we'll get any more level ups and all. So, if we did, then that would be good. But, I don't know if we will. Here we go again, fighting the Goombas. Alright, now let's put the babies through here. And while we find Farfall. Yeah, he's right here. Alright. I say to you, welcome, welcome to Farfall's Bean and Badge! In this place, beans are like precious treasure milked from a famous cow made of jewels. All who came with beans leave with badges so rare they make mustaches droop with disbelief. What are you wanting? We're gonna trade. We got three 138 beans. We might as well get the expensive badges. What's the ulti free badge? No matter how many attack items you use, your stock stays the same. Greatly increase EXP when you defeat enemy. Okay. Um, I'm gonna get ulti free badge. I'm gonna equip that to to Mario. We cannot equip that though. We cannot we buy it. I mean, so we can buy them again. I think I'm not sure. Obviously, we need a lot of beans, but uh, greatly increase all damage both given and receive. Um. Increase damage power when jumping on it. Uh, you know what? I'll get that for Luigi. And then... Uh, greatly increase the power of first attack use in battle. Yeah, because it's likely we're not going to get EXP anymore. So we'll just give that to Baby Mario. And we'll sell things we don't need. Uh, we don't need these mushrooms. Um... Uh, I'm not going to use Super Mushrooms, because obviously we've got tons of Ultra and Max Mushrooms. Uh, Normal Mushroom Drops will also not need. Um, we'll still keep those Mushrooms. We don't need Green Peppers. Uh, to be honest, we don't really use Red Peppers too often at all, but I'm going to have to see if I can. Alright. Alright, I don't need the Bro Flowers either. Or ice flowers, because obviously the final boss does not really use ice. Or smash eggs, really, but we'll keep them anyway. I don't need the pocket chomp. Cannonballers... We'll keep uh, ten of those. we got loads of trampolines. I'm going to sell... I'm just going to sell 42. Copy flowers, we'll need a lot of them, though. Along with mixed flowers. I'm just going to sell one of those, though. I'm gonna sell five of those. There we go. What space trousers? No, I don't want those. Um, uh, lucky badges. What's a hit free badge? Is there many attack? No. Okay. Like, how come that costs less, but this costs? more when I thought the badge A would mean it's like better. 
Uh, obviously, I'll sell the EXP badge because I don't need that anymore. I don't need this. Five, five, five coins. Wow. Um. All right. I'll see if I can equip an item for Baby Luigi first, because um, obviously Baby Luigi still has the coin badge. So let's see. I've got the lucky badge, but I don't know if I should have that or the lucky badge, A. Eh? They say the same thing. How about we use the A version? And we'll sell these, because obviously they're more money. Any clothing? No, we don't have any clothing to sell. Um, <laughs> we don't have the Cobalt Star, Shard any Star Shards anymore. Alright, we're gonna trade, but we're gonna sell. Uh, we'll just sell those. Okay, there we go. Easy. We've got that. Uh, we have a lot of these, so... You know, I'm gonna buy a lot more one-up supers, so I might as well just sell these one-ups. I, I, I'm not really gonna use refresh nerves either, so we'll just sell those as well. I'm, I'm not gonna need. I'm not gonna need a lot of these. I'll just have like ten. So yeah, we'll just have that. Obviously, we cannot buy more badges. If we had like two more beans, we could like. Uh, get a badge, but obviously, uh, I don't really need badges too much. Alright, now let's go back to the Troop Castle, and it's not there, okay. It's this one. Alright, let's, now, we'll go back to the Toad Shop first, before we head off. Oh, we got a Goomba. Oh, we got three of them to fight, okay. Well, at least we can get some EXP. Not that we need them anymore. Whoop. Here we go again. Okay, we got them. I can just imagine if we got some EXP upgrades still. Alright, here we go. I'm just gonna go back quickly. To the shop. Uh, unless there's more badges we can buy here and such, I'm not sure. The cash back. Lucky badge, no. Uh, no, I don't need those. What about clothing? Royal trousers. No, they they mostly down our power, but up our defense. I don't really like those ones. No, nothing though, nothing here. We'll just buy some normal items then. Do, 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 do. So let's just buy some, um, I don't think we'll need more of these, because obviously, uh, we won't be, we'll, we'll use a lot of copy flowers, obviously, we won't be using trampolines a lot, and there's a lot of mixed flowers, you know, I'll buy a couple of more mixed flowers, I'll buy 35 of those as well, well, I'll have 35 of those, right, we'll buy a lot more max mushrooms, because then, we can, um, I'll buy way more 1-Up Supers, just in case. I have 45 of those. 2060, wow, that, that is, like, many years later. Ultra Drops, I'll just get one of those. 1974, that is way past, oh my god. Um... Then again, I won't really need Ultra Mushrooms, so I'll just get all Max Mushrooms. I guess I'll sell all of my Ultra Mushrooms then. Okay. I don't really need Super Drops either, so... So yeah, we're just uh, replacing items, I guess. Um, how many more can we have of these? We can have at least 10 more. Uh, I'm just going to have 60 of these. Like, I know it's a lot, but still, we're going to need a lot. And then 50 of those. And obviously, I don't need those. Um, 
I don't really need a refresher nerve either. But I'll get five of those anyway. We've got seven coins left. Uh, just for a mushroom, but obviously... Uh... You know what, I'll get it. I'll just have zero coins. Why not? There's nothing to sell, so... That'll do for items. Now let's go back. Let's talk to Egan real quick. See what he has to say. The time holds at the past castle is on the fourth floor for us. You stay out of trouble now. Although I guess it's not really an option at this point. Okay. Let's just go... Get our heart block. Yeah, I think it... I think we only saw the heart block in three locations. Uh, Peach's castle... Uh, present. And then the past Peach's castle. And then... There was one other area. I forgot which one it was. I think it was... The, um... The Coopersium that had it. That had the heart block. I'm not sure. I could be wrong. It might be... No, it was Yub's belly. It was Yub's belly that had it. Yeah. I think they're the only places to have the... Unless there, unless there are in more locations. But they're the only places I remember, it. I remember seeing one. So, let's just go up again. Back to the... Because we're gonna take you back to the past. To finally kill Princess Shroob. And the enemies are back. But I'm not gonna fight them. Unless they get in my way. Alright. Now we're back here. And I'm gonna save before... The part where... Where Stuffwell was warning us. The next room. Right, it's right here. We're back here. It's a hard block. Not that I need it again, but okay. Right, so now we are finally ready to conquer Princess Shrew. Doors to the final battle is open. Go, Mario and Baby Mario. Go, Luigi and Baby Luigi. Princess Peach is calling from the inside of the Shroom Invested Castle. Oh, boy. Also, when you save... You notice that the buttons are also in commas as well. But in the American version, they are not like that. They're just all together. But in Japanese and European versions, they are all in commas. Like that. So... It's pretty much better. There's nothing that side other than the pipe. So let's just go on ahead. The final battle. Here we go. Mario, <sighs> Luigi. There's Peach. Thank you so much for coming all this way. Adorable little tykes. Oh, could they be? Why, those babies are Mario and Luigi, are they? Yes, the Mario and Luigi of this part time period. So good to see your new safe. This area is guarded by some mysterious shrewd energy field. I'm afraid it's not. It's not going to be easy to get around it. By the way, how did you manage to come this far? I thought the shrooms put up a barrier around this castle entrance too. What? The Corbon Star? You're gathering shards here in this castle? But that's... it can't be. Could that... be? Mario, you must listen to me. Uh, you see, the Cobot Star! And we get distracted by a massive mothership! The mothership again! It's back! <laughs> There's Princess Shroob and a Shroob server! I'll call him the Shroob server. So, Princess Shroob's drink. Still speaking in a language we can't understand. Mario! 
We are in a dire predicament. We must stop the mothership or this place will squishify. That reminds me, I think there's a soul support upstairs. Maybe you could do something if you can find a way up there. Let's take a look. If we can get the saucer, we may be able to stop that mothership. Hurry up, all of you! And don't worry about me! I'll stay here and wish you a safe return. Thank you, baby Mario. Okay. Mario! Everyone! Save the Mushroom Kingdom! I beg of you! There's nothing up here. Is there anything this side? There's nothing that side either. So let's just go here. Oh, is there something this side? No. And there's another save block here, but I'm not going to hit it yet because this save block is interesting. We'll go to it in a moment. Let's hit that block. Button. And then we have this kind of minigame again. Got a flying hat, it's like. So, the plumbers versus the mothership. So here we go again. We've seen this again before. And this is the last time that the actual boss music plays. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna shoot the... So we're gonna shoot these, um... These shroom shits at the mothership. So yeah, this is the last time the boss music plays. And if it touches us, we fall down. We have health as well. So we gotta be careful. Whoa! Oh, missed. Whoa! Nice! It gave damage to it. gonna have to hit it first. Oh no! We're gonna take damage! Or are we? Oh wow! We gave damage to it. Oh no! We took damage! We both have two health left. The plumbers versus the mothership! Alright, we shot that. Oh no, we're gonna take damage. And we're gonna fall all the way down. Let's get the mothership because it's being naughty. And even if he hit two ships, it doesn't count as two damage. This gets harder. We have one health left for the mothership and us. We really need to hit the mothership. Oh, we missed all oh, that. Successfully dodged that though. Now we go up. Let's wait for the ships to appear. Oh no, we're gonna fail. Alright, we shot that. Let's see if we can win this. No! We lost! No! But don't worry, you're not screwed, luckily. You get a game over? <laughs> you get a game over for that. I thought I thought I thought you just restart it. But no, you get a game over for it. Okay. Well, I guess we're speeding things up here. Well, I drank my cup of tie. Oh my god. Ugh. I think I should safe state. Okay, here. I'm gonna go this way up. We're gonna go on this belly button. I mean, just button. And then. Just be this. 
Here we go again. We're gonna do this again! Do 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 do! Let's go and hit these ships on the mothership! We need to hurt these ships on the mothership! One, two, three, go! There we go! No damage so far! Oh, yes! I think we're winning this time! We need to hit the mothership! I need to hurt these ships by hurting them! Oh, I'm gonna... Oh, yes! No damage whatsoever! Now. Yes. Oh my god. Then it crashes. Then it's back on the head. Part. Now. What's interesting about this save block. Is that. This save block is different. Because w once we hit it, this happens. Oh, my lever! Before hitting that save album, listen. I have invested for the fight program that I downloaded from the mothership. Yes, I realized that I could recommend that it's allow you to travel through time. Using this program, you can return to the recent past. I've decided to call it Stuffwell Special Service Warpulator. Ha 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 ha! Is this something you forgot or especially want to do? I can take you back in time before you rescue Princess Peach. What do you want to do? We can save, don't save, or go back in time. We're going to save. So we can save normally here. Except... The Okay, don't say. Oh, because I want to try and make it so. There we go. We've got the babies. So then I'm going to save. There we go. The, the mothership has been destroyed. Get back to Princess Peach at once. Okay. Let's do that. Right now. Okay. Thank you so! The mothership's impact knocked out the barrier! But where are the babies going? Okay. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Luigi! Get in front of it! Okay, then Mario will do it then. Then? What's gonna happen? <laughs> Jump scare! <laughs> okay. Pr Princess Shroob! <laughs> now you've done it! You're useless now, Peach! Time to finish you! You cannot escape! The kick this kingdom is mine! I will destroy you all! DESTROY! And then another language we can't understand! Princess Shrew! So how her fight works... Is... Uh, you can see, obviously, this meant to be flickering, but it doesn't work properly on an emulator, so... Oh, we got infinite items now, okay. So we're gonna use Copy Flower! But she's guarded by a shield. So what this means... Oh, we missed. We gotta take down her shield. And obviously she has infinite health this way. Okay. Also, we can do this as many times, but it's only a certain amount of time you need to do it after all the red. The shield goes down, and we can attack Princess Shroop herself. Or get hit by the star. And now let's just heal Luigi. One up super. This is why I recommend too much items. Because these this fight is so hard. Though it's not that hard, but still. I'm going to use the copy flower on her again. Time to hurt Princess Shrew. 
Oh, come on, baby Mario! That was so lame. Oh, I wanted to jump on it, whatever. Okay, copy flower. Here we go. Let's do it properly this time. I can do this. Do -do -do -do. Oh, we got a lot of it. How many? 242. That's a lot. Look, luckily, we have infinite items with Mario, but not with Luigi. I think it's one of I think it's one of the badges that also enables infinite items. But it's only to the items you actually have. It doesn't enable infinite items you don't have in your inventory. Oh my god. Please don't tell me I'm going to do the Elder Shrewboy thing. Oh my god, I, I am... Oh, I messed up there. How many damage? 496! And then she does this. Spider! Then... Woo! Oh, we missed! Then you have to hit her with the hammer. And she's back on her shield, so I think we have to destroy the shield again. Because when she's on her chair, it's always shield. So, I'm going to use the copy flower again! We can use the trampoline to make it easier, but obviously, the copy flower makes this faster. We have beaten it. Oh, then she does this. Whoa! And she goes in the air. You reflect that back at her. And we failed to do that. Whoa! Let's start again. Whoa! Yes, we jumped on it. Yes. Okay. Now let's use the copy flower. Come on, can I do this? Oh my god. Oh, I nearly had it there. And then she gets mad by turning into this kind of form. So then, we do this again, until she goes down. I'm doing so well with the copy flower. I think I'm doing well with on an emulator than I did on actual hardware. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. oh my god. Oh my god, oh I missed there. How many damage? 438. And then this again. There we go. Now we gave her damage. Oh, again. Oh, oh, I missed. Oh, yes. There we go. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, we jumped on it. All right. All right. Let's use the copy flower again. We could use the mixed flower, but I'm not going to. I only recommend using that if there's more than one enemy. Oh, yes. We killed her. Yes. Right, that was Princess Shrew, but also, no EXP screen, but you will get it in the American version, but you get zero EXP, so none of that. But the European and Japanese version just skips it, which is better. We must hurry and escape this place! There's the Cobalt Star Shard. Look, that, that's the almost whole Cobalt Star Shard you've been looking for! Yeah. Look, Mario. I have the final shard right here. With this piece, the cobalt will regain its original shape. Oh yeah. But I cannot allow that to happen. Why not? <laughs> uh oh, baby Bowser's back! If you thought I'd give it up on my giving my treasure back, you dumber than your luck! All the time I, I spent hiding 
that I'm waiting is gonna pay off in a big, big way! I'm talking all the treasures for myself, they're all mine! <laughs> then Bowser Jr. puts it back together. Princess Rue. Now it's your turn, sis. Sir! <sighs> Goodbye, Princess Shrew. What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> you know, a mushroom. Oh, oh no! That cardboard star shot! There was. There was another prin shrew princess inside it. What? That's right, Princess Shrewb has a twin sister! What? We never knew this the whole time. When I arrived in this time period, Princess Shrewb immediately attacked me. I instantly grabbed the time spell power source, the cobalt stone, and... Yes, I trapped Princess Shroob inside it, then shattered it. Oh, that makes sense. Then was then that younger prin that younger Shroob princess surprised me and captured me. How are the twins then? Uh huh. Gathering all of the Cobalt Star Shards gave the eldest Princess Shroob all of her power back. And there she is, the elder Princess Shroob. I laugh at you! Mushroom King, Mushroom Heads, perfect its things! You gathered all Cobalt Star Shards without ever guessing the truth! Now I am free! And that horrible, horrible Cobalt Star is no more! I fear nothing now! Do you hear me? Nothing! No! So the identity of the Star Sprite we spoke up to on Star Hill, it was the a it was actually the Shrew Princess who was trapped inside it! Travesty! I will give you a special reward for setting me free! You will love it! And my sister, my dear, sweet, beautiful sister, I will avenge her! And the music starts playing after she jumps in the American version, but it plays as she appears in the Japanese and European versions. That's why it played early. Now in the sky! A language I can't read at all. And now we fight the elder Princess Shrew. It's it. She is harder than the younger one. Mario, Luigi, I'll help. Start the thing to knock some UFOs like so. We're gonna knock these ones, or none at all. Okay. And then she'll grab her chain chomp dog. And guide the chain chomp around. Oh God. I'm trying to jump on the chain shop. Oh my god. Alright, we killed Mario already. Luckily, we got tons of 1-Up Supers. Do -do -do -do. And once again, we are going to use our... Our copy flowers against her. But first, she's got a massive boulder. And she's going to go to Mario. We're just going to hit her multiple times. There we go! Ha ha ha! Now it's time... For the copy flower power against the elder princess Shrew. Okay, give her less damage sword, but yeah, this one is a lot more difficult than the younger one. And I struggle with this fight a lot when I first play. And she's another boss with an automatic attack. And the last to do so. Well, the automatic attack is only in the Japanese and European versions once again. She is the last boss to use the automatic attack as well. So, yeah. Alright. I hope we got these UFOs. Hopefully we can hit some this time. Yes, two of them. Oh, one of them. Oh, we got a smash egg. And then what's she going to do now? Chain Chomp. Where's it going to go first? Oh! Oh, it's going to go there first. Might as well just do that. Oh, what's she going to do now? 
another chain chomp? Come on! Whoa! Oh, we jumped on it. Yes. Seriously, how many chain chomps does she have? Is she rich or something? Is she like the? Is she like the queen or something? I don't know. Wow. Okay. Uh, that is impressive for the amount of dogs you have. But okay. All right. Copy flower again. Do. 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 That's if I don't talk like this. Oh my god. Oh no, I failed. How many damage? 361 and she's gonna do an automatic attack, which is always this running over. And then we do that, there we go. Oh. Peach, come here. I'm gonna hit these ones. Just one? We got another smash egg? Oh, what's gonna happen now? Oh, the boulder, of course. Let's go to Luigi. Oh no! No, we missed! Despite the amount of damage, we still lost Luigi. Right, copy flower, here we go. Here we go. Once again, with the copy flower. Hopefully, I can win this without cheats. Not, I'm gonna have to use cheats, but okay. oh, wrong button! How many damage did we receive? 332. And you're just gonna use automatic attack again. And then, woo! Nice. We're doing so good so far. All right. Can I get two this time? Yes, two. And a fire flower! We don't really need that, but okay. Oh! She can also heal herself. With a drink. The amount of HP she gets, she gets 80 in the Japanese and European versions, but 120 in the American version, yeah. So the fight is a lot harder. Oh, and then she does this. If it's above, you don't jump. If it's below, you do jump! Whoa! Dodge the shockwave! Come on, let me attack- Oh no! Alright, BOOM! That attack is almost easy to dodge. Alright, copy flower again. Hopefully we can do this! Good at this. Oh, I missed there. Four, two, four, and she's going to use her automatic attack again. Oh, oh, okay. More UFOs. Who would have wondered? And then I'm going to hit these ones. None at all! Oh, drink. Drink my cup of tea. Oh, lovely. Okay, right. uh, Meteor. And where's she gonna go to? To Luigi! Please win this time, Luigi. There we go, good boy! Oh, we killed her! <laughs> wow! Okay. But, here comes the hardest part of the game. Peach passes out and she turns massive! Massive tentacles! So what we do here, we're gonna use the mixed flower. The music is so epic here as well. Oh, come on, I didn't use a lot. It'll damage, wow, that's a lot of damage. And she'll do this. This, I struggled with this a lot when I first played this. So much, in fact, I had to use save state. Uh, not save states. I had to use cheat to win this. 
at all. I am not joking. Because I struggle with this so much, I couldn't even do it. So I decided to use cheats. Some of it was easy, but later parts get harder. Destroy those tentacles. And then... We then need to destroy this part of the tentacle. We're going to use the copy flower again. We've got infinite with Mario. Du -du 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 -du. This is the ultimate finale. Princess Shrew is really massive and really horrible to us. Du -du 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 -du. And she'll do this. These attacks is what I struggle dodging. Well, the first part is easy, but later it will get harder. Trust me. I'm going to use the copy flower again. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, okay. Now, with a head, we need to defeat the crown first. The easiest way you do that is cannonballers. Because the cannonballer, if you have a lot of power, you can easily kill these in just one sitting. So we can do that. There! A lot of damage. And now it's down. And UFOs. Do 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 do. Fire, fire. Electric, electric. Can we hit these against her? Oh, we missed two. She'll grow her arms back as well. So. Oh, and then she'll do this as well. Similar to Cackler in Superstar Saga, but even harder. And we kill Luigi. Off we go to fight this boss again. The hardest part is dodging some of her attacks. That is the hardest part. Alright. I'm going to use the Mixed Flower. So then I can destroy her tentacles. Alright, here we go. Nice. Boom! Tons of damage. And then... Doo -doo -doo -doo. The crown will recover. It, you have to destroy the crown because, obviously, it will reduce... Uh, the amount of protections you'll have, so... Oh, no! I should have say stated before this, but whatever. Oh, I, I can't dodge that properly! Now, stop. Please let me heal Mario. This is why I recommend using supers. Because the crown will restore eventually. I think it takes a while to do that, though. All right. Oh, God damn it! I can't do that! Oh! This attack is very hard to dodge! But still. Okay. Oh, no. Alright. Alright, let's heal Mario first. Do -do 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 Hopefully we can attack her head. Well, I'll just use the mixed flower again. She won't recover any HP, look, so that's a good thing. Alright, not a lot, of, but still. Still tons of damage. Oh, oh no, she's going to do this again, no. Electric... Electric fire, fire. Finally, we dodged some of them. Yep, the crown's been restored. Okay. It gets harder when it gets faster. And it gets harder later. But, okay. I'm gonna use the copy flower on this. On her tentacles. Here we go. What? Why did I miss? That was so lame. 
Oh my god. Right, it's coffee flower again, I guess. Please win this time. Oh, wrong button. God damn it. Got tons of damage to it, though. Because these parts have tons of health. It's these attacks that I can't dodge too much. Oh, no. No! Why do you have to kill a plumber every time? And her arms are growing. Oh, these are... This is incredibly hard to dodge. This attack. Very hard to dodge. And yet... We are just the babies. Oh, no. Okay, that was good. Alright, now let's heal our bros. We're gonna spend a while on this fight. Because it's so damn hard. Princess Shroom is annoying. Right, it's the UFO one. You know what, I'm gonna save state this. I'm gonna save it to a completely different slot. I'm gonna save it to... I'm gonna save it to slot zero. Why not? Oh, what, what was it first? I'm... This one. Oh, God. Oh, I was mixed up. Oh, no! Well, not too bad, but still, it's the hardest one to dodge, I'd say. Okay. Okay, there we go. And now, let's use the mixed flowers again. I recommend using mixed flowers, so then... You can kill all tentacles at once. Oh, it's way high now! Nice. Boom! Right, the legs are down. Hopefully we can destroy the crown. Why do I always miss? I think I'm just not used to this on emulator. I'm gonna use the mixed flower again for not just the crown, but also the tentacles. Now dodge this! Th I can't dodge! It's hard as hell. Incredibly difficult to dodge. On an emulator, at least. No more attacks? Thank god. Alright. So I can use the mixed flower. I can do the first part easily. Oh my god. I'm doing well. Yes. Boom! The crown should be defeated as well. Yes! I'm safe state in this because I'm not doing that part again. I'm going to safe state to slot zero again. Fire, fire, electric fire. Just one we didn't dodge. The rest we did, though. Gave her tons of damage, though. So now, hopefully, we can attack her. What? No! I want to attack her! Electric fire, electric fire. There we go. Please let me attack her. Please. Oh no! I can't dodge it! It's hard! Oh my god! It's impossible for me! I did it on my actual DS Lite before, but now I'm not doing it. Oh, oh come on. You're just going to... I think I think she takes turns every time I fail now. Right. Oh, thank God. Now I can attack her. 
I'm just gonna use strictly the copy flower on her head. I don't care. Okay, if we can beat her, I'll be amazed. So I've never, I've never done it successfully before, aside from using cheese. Oh, failed there. How many damage? 306, okay. That's a lot. Oh, now she'll do this. This attack you'll rarely see. You'll have to remember this. Because it's based on memory. Then they'll all get sucked in. But it's unknown if you can get that attack unless you defeat her, but still. Oh no! There we go. Okay. Now it's more! It's way harder this way! Yep, it's harder when there's more. I'm gonna get a one-up super. Hopefully, we can attack her again. Please, can we attack her? Thank God, yes. Okay. We're just gonna focus on her head. Right, here we go. Alright, let's see if we can do this. Oh my God. Heart will go in pain if I win. Ah, oh, wrong button. We got tons of damage though, wow. 461. She has like tons of health. I think she has 3,000 in the Japanese version, and no, 3,000 in the American version, 2,500 in the European and Japanese versions. She, she restored her crown. Can I successfully dodge this this time? Probably not. Oh, yes! Yes, there we go! Oh, no, this again. That is very hard to dodge. No, not jump. Heal Luigi. The game was lagging a bit there. Should speed things up a bit. Okay, now I'm going to use the mixed flower. Here we go. Why is the game lagging now? That's why I messed up. The game is lagging a bit. Okay. Alright, this again. There we go. There we go! Finally, we're dodging this easily. Oh no, not this again. Oh, it's the other way now. It's hard to dodge! Then Mario's in pain. Oh my god. Alright, so I'm gonna focus on this again. Hopefully we can do this. And yeah, you have to destroy the legs in order to get the crown because you cannot reach it otherwise. Wow, we got a lucky! Okay. Of course she's going to attack more. I'm going to save state this because obviously I don't want to do that part again. Successfully dodge it. Yes. Yes. Okay. No. Oh my god. No. I'm just going to have to do it with Luigi then. Mash B. As fast as we can. Oh, just one damage. She'll marry what? God, I'm spending ages on this fight. Right, now let's use the mixed flower again. Right, 
this should destroy all of them. Yes! My legs as well. Not a leg, seriously? Oh, now this is where the memory comes in. I think it was fire first. You can easily just tell by the shadows as well. Okay, right, we successfully dodged some of them. But yeah, that's the hardest part. It involves memory. No, not this again, no! This is so hard, oh my god. Right, stole Mario. Do, 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 do. All right, so I'm gonna have to use the copy flower on her legs, or the foot rather, as the game calls it. I'm gonna try and attack her for a bit up here. Or not, it didn't work. I've done about five damage. Wow, that's a lot now! Wow, we've dodged most of them. Okay. Oh, no, not this again. Oh, they're in different times now! Come on! Okay. We'll heal Luigi. Please let us use the cannonball attack to destroy her crown. Okay, thank god. I can use that to destroy the crown. And then... There we go. It's about 200 health, yeah. Oh, then this again. I'm safe state in this. Um, again. I don't like this part. Electric fire. Electric. Electric. Fire. Fire. Okay. Why am I always failing? Oh, it involves dodging. Successfully dodged that. Alright. Oh. Oh god, how many times? Oh my god. Might be close to finishing though. Oh god! How many times are you gonna do that attack? Oh my god. Is that enough, woman? Elder Princess Shrew. The fat Princess Shrew. <laughs> okay. Please let me attack. Right, there we go. I'm just gonna use the coffee flower on her head. Or just Princess Shrew. It just classes her as Princess Shrew, even though it's Elder Princess Shrew. Okay, can we win this? I'll be amazed if I do. God. Yes! We've won! Yes! Oh my god! First try as well! Oh my god! Finally! Legitimately done this fight with no cheats. Foolish mushroom heads! You may have bested me, but shrooms will live on. One day the shrooms will dance on the bur buried remains of this pathetic kingdom. <laughs> oh my god! No cheats this time. Thank god. Princess Shrooms, an old, old plain, a plain old mushroom, and you've got her. We'll go back down. Mario, Luigi, thank you. Thanks to you, the Mushroom Kingdom of this time is safe. I am so very, truly pleased. <laughs> oh, of course, they're playing with that mushroom that baby Bowser turned into. These poison mushrooms, how shall we be rid of them? The foul work of the shrooms will cover, covers our land. Okay. Wait, jump on Luigi. Oh, baby Mario. But it turns back into baby Bowser. Yeah. Ah, the mushroom. Could it be? 
baby's tears? Okay. Just keep on getting upset, baby Luigi. The Hydro Gush. Oh god, it's Professor Egan again. Yep, it is. Fire it up. Yeah, that is so awesome, Egad. Genius idea. Wow, okay. It's going everywhere. These areas remind me. We might have not gotten every beans in every area, but at least... We've got ones that we can, so there might be still some in Bowser's Castle and such, but I'm not going to bother getting them. The toads are saved in the Toadwood Forest. Those mushrooms are gone in Toad Town. And then Toadbert and Kylie Cooper are saved as well. The liquid of hy Hydro Gush is spouting has uh, the same chemical makeup as the baby's tears. Spraying it across the kingdom out to cure all the shrew mushrooms. I am plumb astounded. The fearsome shrews laid low by baby tears. My treasure! Prince Bowser, please let it go! There's Egad. <laughs> Why, look, even the time time machine is completely restored. I've engineered it to run off of energy from the time holes. Professor, did it work? What happened? Yep. As soon as I got the information from Stuffwell, I put our plan into action. The brain of baby tears hit the shroom, shrooms and they melted immediately. Success! That takes care of every last trace of the Nastival Shrews. Happies! Yep, and it's time to head back to our proper place in time. The Toad Swerves must be besides themselves with worry. Back to the future, here we come! Gonna take you back to the present, or the future. Here we go. So much cleaning. Actually, there's something interesting to see in this castle. Don't worry, you can come by later. You can find me in my usual location, fellas. Princess! Oh, my dear princess, you're safe at last! Thank you! We owe Mario and the babies a great debt. Oh, not Luigi? Okay. Princess, please come this way! Ready, set! Hey, Luigi! Welcome back! Okay, I have to do that. You must be all so tired! Please come this way! And now we can just wander about in Peach's castle. But there is a save area, but... And the, the toads are guarding, so we cannot go past them. But this save block is also interesting. It does the same thing as the previous one. Is there something you forgot the special one to do? I can take it back. Um, I am not going to save. But I will... No, I said I won't save. Because I'm going to save state. I'm going to see... I'm going to show you guys what it's like when you save like this. Because I can just load the state. But back in Peach's castle... 
The shrooms have been beaten. Who knew with baby tears with their bane? It's time to party! <laughs> okay, just kidding. <laughs> okay. Alright, uh, we're just gonna load that state because I just want to keep my previous save. Alright, anyways, now, with our babies, let's go up ahead. Here we go. Oh, oh, you saved the princess and the kingdom! Well done, dear fellows! Master Mario! Master Luigi! Young Master Mario! Young Master Luigi! From the bottom of my heart, I thank you for rescuing our Princess Peach! Please come this way, sirs! There's a favour I must ask all of you! And now, at long last, I must bid farewell to my younger... and rear herself. Hmm? Is that as far you can get away to get rid of me, you old toad? Yes, uh, what, what an overacting imagination you possess! Bowser? Will someone please tell me how this happened? Apparently, he fell from high and landed in, in the time hole. Then he just plopped into the castle's backyard. Yes, yeah, since then, he's been out of the light. Master Mario, there's nothing you can do. Perhaps jump on him or some such thing. Hmm. What? Okay, just jump on him. There's nothing. Oh no! Aha, baby Luigi, what is that grotesque mushroom? Oh, what's gonna happen? That's Princess Shrew. Elder Princess Shrew. Oh. Ew! That's disgusting! Snarful. <laughs> Bowser has purple eyes and. Bowser's all rainbow! Yes! Oh my god! I can feel the power burning in my belly button! What in the world did you feed me? Uh, Elder Princess Shrew, do you like her? <laughs> <laughs> uh, who cares what it was? I've been reborn! Stars, and you brats too! No mercy for you! And we're gonna save state here because this is the proper final fight! Bowser! But then he's gonna spit some purple smoke out to then reveal a ghost of Elder Princess Drew and an interesting health system! Hey, listen here! From now on, you guys get no chance to attack! I'm gonna flatten you with an attack barrage, baby! Enjoy! <laughs> yep, you cannot use your own attacks now. And, uh, you can only counter-attack him. So with the power of counter-attacks, you just gotta hit him. And it'll reflect it and hurt the Princess Roop. Ah, sorry, no attacking! So then... Dodge these attacks and then they fly all the way above her. Now, although there's no name given in the actual game, the name of this boss is Shrouser. Yeah, it's basically Shrew mixed with Bowser. Yeah, Shrouser. Not to be confused with trousers, but okay. You can't dodge them all! <laughs> oh, yes, we can! Whoa! Oh, I missed. You know what? I'm gonna. Because Luigi's dead, we gotta. We gotta do this with all the bros alive. Do 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 do. Alright. Let's try this again. Because this fight is so hard. You also pay attention to Shru Princess Shrub herself to see who she's pointing at. If she's pointing at Mario, it goes to Mario. If it's Luigi, it goes to Luigi. Sorry, no attacking! I don't care. We can counter attack. Okay. Yeah, it's an interesting health system that only occurs in this fight. So yeah, it's not in any other fight in this game. Boom! Ah, you can't touch them all! I don't care. And then, 
So we're gonna do this again. Oh god. Oh no! Luigi's dead! And Mario's dead as well. God damn it. I wanted to do it with all of them alive. It doesn't matter if they're all alive or not, it's just it's just a matter of winning. Alright. Let's try this. Whoa! 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 There we go! Hey, sorry, no attacking! I don't care. Boo! Oh, come on! Oh, I forgot this was not a uh, hammer, it's this. Alright, come on. Do 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 Princess Shrew. Boom! Nice! Alright. You can't dodge them all! Alright, this again. Okay. Oh, nice! Oh no, why do I keep killing Luigi? Oh my god. I just want to keep doing this alive. I go for this again. Here we go again, doing Schrauser. Beat him up, beat him up. Okay. Uh, sorry, no attacking. Alright. Okay, though. I'm going to hurt you! Ha 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 ha! Dodge these by jumping. They're just homing onto it. Okay. It's like he's weak to his own attacks, but yet he uses these attacks. Okay. Nice! Yeah, you can't dodge them all! Okay. Last part. Boom! Lovely! Four more shrooms to go. Good jump. Two more. Pesky bugs! Okay. Wow, that's a big one! Boom! And then... One more time! There! We have done! We've won! Yes! What? What? No! The Princess Room dies and then Bowser does. Lovely! We're all relieved. They're just standing on top of him. And... We have finished the game! Everyone! Okay. Elder Stoosworth, we've had our share of disagreements, but now the time is nigh, I find it rather difficult to say farewell. Younger me, please take good care of the little princess. Ah, baby princess, leave me a big smile for the final time. Toad Sonsworth's twist! She loves it. Baby Mario, Baby Luigi, thank you for rescuing me and saving the kingdom. Please look after my younger self and young Toastworth. Oh, yeah. hmm? Hammer. Mario Gun has it. And then, they play with the babies. One last time. No. Bye bye. <laughs> okay. Let's go. No. <laughs> <laughs> Again, we know this was gonna happen. Unless the Ouija has something else. Okay. Baby 
one up. Yep, the last remaining cookie from Yoshi's Island! And then, maybe Luigi gives Louis the hammer to normal Luigi, but he still gets dizzy. Is everyone alright? I think that's what it said. My dear Princess Peach, you've grown so beautiful, I'm honoured to have met you! And Master Mario, Master Luigi, thanks ever so much! Do continue to take care of the princess! Then... We all wave goodbye to the babies. Younger me, keep your chin up. Babies, thank you. We all wave goodbye. <sighs> well, why is the screen flickering? And that is the... And why is the screen flickering? Oh my god. Oh well, you, you, we're gonna have it like this apparently. Uh, just hold on, guys. Okay, I could not fix it, unfortunately, guys. I have to leave it like this, unfortunately. But it seems to happen random, so. I don't know if the credits is being inverted as well. Uh, let me just sort. Let me just see that. I've oh, set it to bottom screen first, okay. Hmm. Oh, wait, hold on. Um, main screen first. So I just realised the, yeah, the credits are so messed up on an emulator. I don't know why. Um, we're we'll just gonna have to leave it like that, unfortunately. But at least we get to see the pictures. We're we'll just gonna have to leave it like that, unfortunately. Hopefully, uh, the only time it will happen on an emulator. But, but yeah, that was Mario and Luigi Partners in Time. I gotta say. Oh wait, no, it's not messed up. I thought. I thought it was like top screen at the bottom or something, but no. But no, I, I, I was wrong. But yeah, we could just see all the pictures in the game. So yeah, what I think of Partners in Time. Partners in Time is literally my favourite in the series, I gotta say. So yeah, I just enjoy it so much. And yeah, Bowser capturing Peach. But it was actually Princess Shrew. So yeah, I actually like Partners in Time so much. I like it more than Superstar Saga. Even more than Bowser's Inside Story and Dream Team, I'd say. I think Partners in Time has to be my favourite. Uh, not just on the DS, but of all time in the Mario and Luigi RPG series, anyway. <laughs> There's Luigi crying in front of the star, the star door. I, I was so grateful of fighting the final boss with no cheats this time because I used to struggle with that a lot as a kid when I first played it back in 2020. Yes, during the COVID years is when I finished this. <sighs> There's the last picture. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's all flickery, so might not be able to see it properly. Unless we will. And then, this. Yep, that theme song only plays in the Japanese and European versions and later American versions. It does not play in the original American versions, that special theme tune there. But as you can see, we have done it. We have finally finished Mario and Luigi Partners in Time. <sighs> I love this game so much. Well, not, not ever, but I mean like, Love the Mario Luigi game. So yeah. 
let's see what it says here. You save albums to save your progress as you go along. This will keep track of your adventure and hints you received. Okay. So, yes. Partners in Time was a great game. Is a great game. Not was a great game, oh god. So, yeah, I pretty much enjoy this one more than the other Mario Luigi games. Also, well, depending on when you save at the title screen, you'll either have just Mario and Luigi, just Baby Mario and Baby Luigi, or all of them on the clocks on the title screen. The only times you'll have just the babies is when the the, the, the adult bros are sucked through the nostrils. Remember that in Vin Factory, where they're sucked through the nostrils? Yeah. It's the only time you can pretty much... And you'll have a different versions of the Nintendo logo as well. Uh, that plays. Uh, you can look them up yourself. So, yeah. So, yeah. Partners in Time has to be great, I gotta say. It's really awesome, and uh, I definitely recommend you go and get it. Uh, 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 no matter what version, you can play any. Uh, I, uh, when I first played, when I played, when I finished this back in 2020, I played the Japanese version, uh, which is also called Mario and Luigi RPG 2x2. Which is the 2x2 two two part, meaning because you have two adults, two babies. So it's not, you don't say it as two times two, you just say it as two by two. So yeah, it's interesting. So, I think we'll end things off here then, guys. And obviously, we got the rumble feature enabled. So yeah. So yeah, it's kind of cool to have the rumble features as well. Uh, not that we really need it, but still. So... That'll be it for Mario Luigi Partners in Time then, guys. Thank you so much for watching the series. I really enjoyed this playthrough. It was really creative and a bit funny. Lots of crying in it with the babies, but still. But still really good. So, I shall see you guys next time when we do a next game. It'll, it's probably going to be Bowser's Inside Story. But we'll see on that. So, I'll see you guys next time. JP Bow. See you guys next time. Bye!